Hello, welcome to my Adobe Photoshop tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to create neon lines. Just copy a file from the internet. Adobe Photoshop. This is what the result should look like. Go to new file. Transparent background. Here we have our image. Create a new layer. My Amazon is beeping. Take a nice brush side. I don't know what you should like, but you might go to very fat, but I like to use quite a little one. So I go to 17. That's my dot. Tip, take the underside and not the upper sides. The upper side are just full ones. Now select a new layer. Go to the pen tool, it's uh, either here, if you have used another tool of that, and then start drawing a line. I've practiced this so I can do it really fast. But if you make it for like a magazine, then it won't be nice if you do it my my uh, tempo. Then just do it easier. Stroke path. Select brush over here. There are lots. Simulate pressure off. Press OK. It isn't a nice result, but that's because I'm making a video. Set the opacity a bit lower than, except if you want it like that, but I don't like it. Right mouse click, still with your pen tool selected. Delete path. This is a new line. Now, if you thought the color you started with was nice, then you don't have to do this step. Press Ctrl U if you don't like the color. There will appear something with U saturation over here. Set it to colorize. You can set the saturation up as much as you want. And you can take just another color, whatever you want. I like to use today green for a little bit darker green. So this is what I want. Now you see it is all over the place. It is it's even like she has a mustache over there. So that's uh, quite ugly. Now take your eraser tool. It's uh, over here. Today I'm going for a zigzag effect. It means that. Uh, there's a line and there's not a line, there's a line, there's not a line. I like that effect. Okay, let's erase this, all of this. If you'd like to do multiple colors, you can see the end of the video soon because uh, it's over there how you can fix that little mistake over there so pass back like that let's see over there and then back to here okay you get the point I think here we got it I uh, deleted the the top path if you don't like to do that you can't so now we have this go to filter liquify here we can tighten the edges up a little bit brush size let's see like every corner it should be just click twice very short you see you get quite a, a nice edge. I'm doing it real quick. And now, take this one, it's under it. 
It was now first the second tool, the pucker tool, it's under S. Now the blow tool, it's under B. Just take once at all sides. Now once above and under it. So that's quite quick. Okay. We've tightened the edges up a little bit. Let's see. Looks nice. Now, once we've got this, you can uh, either take multiple colors. That's quite a loved thing. Uh, let's see. Uh, over here, there is a rainbow color. Huh. Funny. So, now, just grab it over with a gradient tool. Whoops, wrong. Sorry, uh, how did I do that usually? Where was that? I forgot to do that. At least I'll explain it later in the comment. You can either take that over, but the transparency is going with. And I don't know how to do that again. Look as you see. You either get that. Okay, thanks for watching my Photoshop tutorial this far. Maybe I'll explain it later in a total video, but I don't think I'm going to do that. So here you got your nice neon colored video, and here you got it.